what are the top three to five improvements we should be looking at doing to get the most bang for buck return? That's a good question. And kitchen and bathrooms are going to be differentiators, right? Like that's a really good way to invest and get money back because those are important to people. But when it comes to a rental, man, if it's clean and move in ready, that's important. So like fresh paint and carpet goes a really, really long way into really freshening up a property. And most of the time, people just want to feel like they're in a safe, clean place. They're not looking for the fancy stuff. But that also is going to go into what is the market. So like are all of the other homes in the area updated and brand new that you're competing with to where you're not going to get the tenant that you want simply because you're choosing to not do these improvements. That could be a problem. So it's going to be market dependent. You also don't want to put a brand new bath and kitchen in on a property where nothing else in the area has that because now you've over improved the property. Going back, be a market expert, be an area expert. And I like to, to be a little nicer than the area because I want to attract that tenant. 